Hello, family. Thank you for coming over to the house tonight. And just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the SKB. We're kicking. Just kick it. Just kick it. Okay, you don't come to another episode where we're going to be asking the question of... Why are you telling my business? Don't be telling my business. Hmm. Why not? Because a can-can and a can-can, a can-can, a can-can, and a wheel. Now we're off to... Hello, fam, and thank you for coming over to the house tonight. Okay? And we're going to be talking about the mess with Blueface getting arrested. And for y'all go, go try to get me in the comment section. I am stuffed up with a cold. Because in Atlanta, it get hot, then it get cold, and then it get medium. You don't know how to and what to wear with the weather up here. Okay? Or down south, I should say. But we got Carlissa. She's speaking on her son's name. She's bringing up Krishan. She's bringing up Jaden. And she's blaming both women for the uh, fact that her son is in jail. I'm like, Carlissa, if you don't go sit your little ass down somewhere, I mean, sit it down. Get in the middle of the room and look. No, how you say it? No, get in the middle of the wall, at the corner of the wall, and don't take yourself out until I've come and gotten you and I've said so you can come out. Because you're the only mother... That I know it really sticks their noses into other people's business, such as your son and these two ladies that he keep running after. Now, I don't know why Krishan is still up there. Unless her, uh, her and uh, Blueface are just trying to make something more interesting. Because how many times have he denied your son? And Carlissa, you were right there denying it too. You were trying to put Jaden on the pedestal. But she didn't need to be on the pedestal herself. But she might not fool around with men, but she damn sure fool around with women. Because she dating one right about now. But I was just wondering, because it kind of pissed me off with her and Krishan being together and spent that little time abundant. Why is Krishan still trying to go after Blueface? That's what I'm trying to figure out. And both of y'all don't swap stories. And y'all know he's the common denominator of when and where Y'all can start a conversation. Because I know you were checking her. You were chin checking her on her calling you a bitch every time. And I'm like, just go ahead, Jalen. Sit her in her place. Sit her down. Tell her what you're not going to sell from her. And let it be known. Okay? That's what I would have did, Jay. But uh, allegedly, y'all had went over Blueface house one time. And uh, it was one time too many. And y'all had strolled everything on the floor. Y'all just, and it wasn't even Christmas time yet. It still had the Christmas tree up and all that good stuff. And y'all gonna go tell the man how so what he said was tore up. We just gonna see some broken glass. You know, it could have come from a cup, a plate, or uh, a wine bottle. I, I don't know. It's not even no, here nor there at this point. And then uh, Blueface called himself going over there and buy her a house. I'm like, with who, honey? With what money? Because I'm pretty sure you tell her the same thing. Y'all ain't got no money. I I had to get my takeout of it. And then some other departments needed to get their takeout of it. And really, you didn't have nothing left. He's going to treat her just like he treated Krishan. Krishan felt like, hey, I need to get a hold of my money. I need to see what's coming in from these different uh, entities that we're sitting performing for so she you know she got smart at the end but dumb as hell still dumb as hell i hear she's down at the courthouse surely she ain't still there but she went out to the courthouse because she knew Blueface was going to be locked up okay and they said he ain't give a one year probation i'm like what the hell is that you know other people have done lesser than that and got five to ten years life then come out to find out that it was evidence misplaced and it should have been on this other person's record and got piled on at another person's record. I'm like, ah. So, with his uh, gang affiliation, I guess they're going to just want to come in there and tag him and see what he knows about certain things. And then they're going to let him back out. He's almost like the snitch. But uh, I don't understand why Carlissa, Carlissa 
just all up in the Kool-Aid, don't know what the flavor is. She's just going to jump in line, want her, her uh, drink poured, and then she'll move on. But And I do understand that she helped uh, Blueface with his career a lot longer than her other kids uh, because uh, he was doing commercials when he was a little boy. So I kind of felt that he wanted to stay in the industry, but Brother Man can't rap. <coughs> if he getting that thing out of it, as far as publicity, it's with that show, Krishan and, and Rock's Love or something like that. Uh, Blueface and Krishan, Rock Love, I, I don't know. Never saw it. That's only on the uh, backs of it's going off. And I'm like, oh, that's interesting. And I never got a chance to really watch it. But that's no to hear nor there again. What I'm coming to talk about is why do you, well, I, you know what? It's just Jay, not Jay, it's uh, Carlissa and Krishan. And how can you be with somebody that beat down your mama? That's why I said, oh, y'all got issues. Y'all got some issues. But anyway, they say Krishan was sitting down on the step with baby Krishan Jr. What the hell does that make? What sense does that make? That child gonna get a, a, a bad cold and he gonna be fighting for his life or whatever because y'all still do this bad Back ass country ass stuff. Like piss poor, piss poor judgment. That baby needed to be inside warm and somebody else taking taking uh care of him until you can get back. Because how many times he denied baby junior? More than you can count on your toes or your fingers. He done denied the baby I don't know how many times. And then I was just trying to figure out was uh blue face daddy was he gay, y'all? Is he gay? He looks so good. And he's playing for the same team. Anyway, it is what it is. Because the only reason I was saying that because he had that light blue uh, fingernail polish when he was calling himself uh, babysitting or sitting there with his grandson for the very first time. All right? But I'm, I'm still, I'm not understanding. It seems like Jaden is moving on. She's, um, she's tired of the bullshit. She don't give a shit anymore because he's still going to mess with her if she allows it, go back to Krishan, then probably pick up another chick on the side that neither one of them know about. I mean, talking about a travesty, a train wreck. Woo, put them to bed. Uh. But, you know, sometimes I think Blueface is just a little op. You know what I'm saying? He has to come in and out of jail uh, so he could tell the big people in jail what's going on on the streets. But that's just my theory. My theory, my theory alone. Okay? It's allegedly but sometimes my mind just goes there to think, like, okay, why is he smiling when he's being asked to come and submit his life to them? <laughs> and then a judge will kindly pay him back on what parts of jail time he actually is going to get. But you can see everybody can be going out everybody. I'm not, I'm not going to generalize. Some people will make it seems like it's a good deal for you to do wrong to a certain person and what you could benefit from that. You see what I'm saying? You see where I'm going? Y'all connecting the dots. Because Blueface is a pitiful, pitiful, pitiful soul matched with Krishan, which is how he said, if a, if a, a, a itch don't lay down, a itch won't get fucked up. Something like that, y'all. I was like, no, he didn't try to rhyme because it, it, it sounded like he was trying to rhyme. But that's what he was telling Christian. Uh, Christian was asking him, why does he beat on her? Why he beat he her like he hit the man? I said, well, Christian, we don't see you put your hands on him, too. Okay, you always a touchy-feely person. That person probably was, just want to sit by you and just enjoy whatever time y'all spending with each other. They don't want your, hand, their, your nails in their hands and their hair. They want you to do that. You did that shit with K-Swab, and we see where you are with him. He got rid of you, didn't he, Christian? I know he did. Because you're not the kind of woman that he usually dates. So if you go on his profile, you're going to see the kind of women he dates. And I ain't saying they're white. But they ain't, uh, you know, chocolate brown either. But uh, let's see what we got here. <sighs> I just pulled something up. And I'm just going to go to the uh, comments section. Because I don't told y'all what I felt about it. Now it's time for you to understand what the commenters on the video is talking about. And then you get down and as the video ends, you go on down there to that comment section and put your two cents in, okay? So 
Because one thing was certain, two things for sure, Krishan going to be there. You talking about a real ride or die chick. I call her a foolish myself, fraudulent, fakery, fuckery behavior, but that's not me. You know, thinking I know everything. I'm just giving them, I'm just relying on what they're showing me and giving you an observation of what I feel about it. Okay, but uh, the first Carmetta said that psychic on TikTok said he was going to jail this year. Is that psychic metal, y'all? Because she was talking about somebody else. I think it was Kim Porter. If her name is Bella. But y'all uh, let me know in those comments if that was the uh, actual person. She's a white lady, short haircut, uh, very, very, looking very intense every time I did catch her uh, talking about celebrities or a certain person that was going to pass on. But uh, yeah, that was the first comment. The second is, uh, comment it says, he's the real leader of YSL. <laughs> Call me to the stand, Your Honor. I'm like, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Hey, well, it's YSL from Atlanta, y'all. Or did they migrate here? I don't know. Everybody was coming here after that Katrina uh, debacle, man. Everybody and their mama. Okay, then we got another one said, uh, Krishan sitting on the steps with the baby waiting to hear the bun about. And it's like, it should not have been a bun. He should not have been able to bail out. Give me one week of your life, okay? I'm going to put you in solitary confinement. I don't want you out there with the general population. I want you in solitary confinement so you can have some time to think about stuff. Think about what woman you want to be with and let that be done. Because you don't have your fun. I'm sure you don't have your fun up and down them Hollywood streets, okay? Blue face. Oh, let's see. Another one wrote, What y'all all had for lunch today? <laughs> oh, no. This person didn't want to talk about it. She was just hungry. And she was like, Okay, I'll let y'all say what y'all got to say. But then I need some uh, advice on what to cook tonight. So that's priceless. That's priceless. Oh, uh, let's see. Somebody else said, It was so quiet for the past few weeks. I guess because they weren't making their headlines debut. That's why y'all need us, us bloggers, to tell y'all what's going on. And we're going to always say alleged. <laughs> we, we don't know nothing for certain. We only know what they're showing us. And then we have to question ourselves, is that what we're really seeing? Or is that something stage propped up? You know what I'm saying? That they thought they would put one on over us. But, uh, yeah, that was cool. Okay. Uh, another person wrote, just go to his mama page. She posted the situation. <laughs> I shall not go to her page because it makes her look stupid to be talking about her son, her daughter, and her other son so downwardly. You know, like she put them down and they don't know nothing without her. So, uh, no, I won't be going over to her channel, seeing in and everything. Because she makes the headlines of the blue face and Krishan anyway. And I'm still trying to figure out how Krishan was able to whoop her butt, to whoop her behind. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about Blueface Mama. I, even if it was a sucker punch, Mama, you didn't have nothing to come out with. Girl, like some mace, some, uh, I wouldn't say knives, but they like little things you put on your hand that's sharp. I, I can't think of it right now. But uh, she, do you have anybody like Edward Seals or hands running around there? Because that would get both Krishan and Blueface or wake up call. Uh, then we got uh, another commenter said putting his hands on women finally caught up with him. Uh huh. Yeah, it sure did. And that's why I say he needs to spend one week in solitary confinement for him to think about all these gruesome and gory things he's done to women. Because he's like, uh uh, he got a girl, a baby girl that's growing up and gonna be a woman. Do you want that same thing to happen to your baby girl that you've been doing to Jada and Krishan? Is the picture got to get a little bit home-based for you to have some type of feelings about it? Oh, then we got Kim. Where it says, keep him, please. I beg <laughs> Girl, if it was uh, up to the public, um, what do you call it? The people. <laughs> going up against uh, Blue Face. Yes, that would be a, a all day good thing. Let's just keep him in, uh, what do you call it, Sol solitary confinement for at least five years, six years, seven. Ten would be the most, okay? Then he can come out and be with nobody. He just on his own, meditating, doing whatever they do, 
when they're uh, separated from the general population. Oh, Lord. But I can't understand why Chris Shaw was there talking about allegedly she's going to get his bill money and bail him on out. Like, well, don't you let WAC 100 do that. That's his manager. Or, yeah, that's about it. Because Jane ain't standing there. See, nope, she done went with another girl. She's having a fabulous time, okay? Oh, a stupendous time. <laughs> Whoa, boy, they just trips the hell out of me, how they do stuff. And that, was, that writing was too little for me to try to add it up. But we know he's uh, on the books now. We know he's on the books. And he's going to have to play fair when they let him out in society. Because technically, if somebody report him about he did this, 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 you know, this that, and the third, okay, and you had confirmation because you actually saw it, uh... I don't see why he keep getting out of jail myself. Like, like, like I said, unless he's an op, like he's playing both fields, because nobody else have even went. They done lesser than what he called himself doing, and they end up going to jail for a long time, a long time. Well, let's go back to the, uh, let's see, back to the article. Uh, let me see. Uh, the internet has been so peaceful. Yes, it has. Yes, it has. But y'all got to den- Y'all can't deny. Y'all was looking for something for Chris Shaw and, and the blue face. Were you? <laughs> I know you was. I know you was. We, you, you ought to be scared to say it. They are very entertaining. Very much so. But I didn't understand why Wack 100 was there. Because the blue face was turning himself in. The only person that needed to be there was his lawyer and himself. Okay? His lawyer and himself. Krishan didn't have no business down there. Uh, his brother didn't have no business down there. The blue like he know everything. He knows he can uh, create a stir or panic amongst people. And he does it. He does everything for, uh, what do you call it? He tries to be sensational with it, like a sensational uh, glorified book or sensational play you're putting on or you know you just did something and it was sensational did I say that right sensational okay my mind going every which way but the right way okay so forgive me fam I'm trying to report some news to y'all not really feeling that good but I need to get up and sit in my chair and drink you know some juice here and then some tea there just to get on stop you know what I'm saying Let's continue to go on. Let's continue to go on. One other commenter said, laughing my F off. I'm dead. Somebody said, keep him for 20 years. No reason. It's her, it's their birthday. Great way to kick it off. It is a blue face birthday today, y'all. Get in the comment section and let me know. Because I guess we could say happy birthday to him. Okay. And we wish him many, many more. Yeah, he's arrested. I think it was supposed to come before this time. But either or, he's arrested. He's uh not out on bond yet, from what I understand. Because he just got a year probation. So he might have already left. Uh-huh. He might have already left for the jailhouse. And he's probably either uh have a Christian over his house or whatnot. And doing it what it make it to. But like I said, I'm so sick of Krishawa. Anybody deny my baby, and I know I'm you, the only person that I've been with, even though I may have a salty past or mess with several men at one time, and probably not using a condom, which I don't know why you want to play, and then you're going to pay later on. Why you want to play? And you're going to pay for it later on. Always wrap yourself up unless you're in a relationship that you know you're male counterpart or your female counterpart is not doing anything with anyone else. You see what I'm saying? And that's a hard pill to swallow because, you know, people just get divorced for anything these days. Not necessarily for infidelity, but just stupid ass shit. You don't look good no more. You don't act the way you used to act when we were just dating. And go, you go, go on several times through the pages and understand, like, where did they come from? They must have love each other. The only thing I could say is not forgivable, but you can forgive them, but don't give them no second or third chance and just move on with your life. It's infidelity. Because you're going to be playing in your head, well, w- what would the girl have or had 
that I didn't have. Uh, how did she do the position? It's going to be a lot of questions that you're going to want to answer, but the guilty part is not going to want to participate in that, okay? Yeah, because they probably still seeing the chick or bro, and they feel in their mind they're going to continue to see them. They're just not going to let you know about it. So it's almost like you got to be, let me see, uh, you got to be cool and know your rights and know who's fooling around and who with. You know what I'm saying? Who the hell those, please? Okay. Talk about that. But yes, as the video saying, he is arrested. But my thing is, y'all know, I think he ended up for something else. Okay, that's my thoughts. And my thoughts alone. <sighs> but yeah, he was, uh, how you say it? He was happy to know that he could dress real well. I'm like, man, they weren't going to put you in an orange jumpsuit. You probably didn't even go by the part where they register you again. They put you behind or put you in front of these numbers that tells how high you are and all that stuff. They already got a lot of them on file, I'm pretty sure. And shout out to Ruby Kai. Go and check her video out or her videos out. They're really good. And tell them that I sent you over there, okay? Yes, Ruby Kai. She's a great... Uh, YouTuber, and she's been doing it for a while, and you know, that's a good thing. It's a good thing when people can just uh, tell about another person that's doing a similar video or a reaction type video. They should be honored and blessed, okay? Honored and blessed. Oh, but let's see here. Well, that tripped me out. <laughs> they try to say keep it for 20 years. My lord, 20 years. Well, he is still kind of young, so he probably can work with that ideal time of being released from prison. Hell, Jaden probably said, don't ever release him. You know what I'm saying? He made her go all the way back to loving on a girl, which she really wanted to love on a man. But then I'm sure she had to see before six months ended that this ain't the type of man that's going to be a family. He's going to always be out there. Papa was rolling stone. You hear me? Wherever he laid his hat was his home. Woo! And when he died, all was left was spoiled, what to say, alone. Something like that. Yep. But, you know, please do subscribe to the channel. Comment, like, share. Turn on those notification bell buttons. A button when you'll know when I drop down a video for you to upload and, and take a good shot at it. Okay? Just take a good look at what I'm talking about. In that few seconds where I post it. But that's all I got. I ain't got no more. I will see you ladies and gentlemen on the next video. And remember, share this caring. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. And that's all I got for y'all. I'll see y'all on the next video. Okay? Ta-ta. Bye-bye.